Top of the morning to you. Welcome back to a brand new I Rate Your Teams video. For cheap, fast, and reliable FIFA 20 Ultimate Team coins, check out u7buy.com and use code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. Now, as we get towards the latter stages of FIFA and FIFA 20, we do have a couple months left of the game. However, I don't think people's teams are realistically going to change a whole lot in those couple of months. I'm going to start making these episodes a little bit shorter, uh, a little bit sweeter, and I'm just going to start showcasing teams as opposed to like giving you guys ideas because I'm not going to lie, EA giving us free players and really cheap players on such a level, uh, it goes better than what any advice I could possibly give you does. I mean, for example, today we got ourselves a Paul Pogba SBC and this SBC is a 95 rated card for 300k. Like, if you have anywhere near enough coins to do this or you just have fodder in the club, you you might as well do it. He's a 10 out of 10 in my opinion. He is absolutely incredible. He's great in game and I think he's fantastic on the pitch. Um, so like, my advice there isn't going to make much of a difference because you're probably going to go completely SBC anyway. Um, so we're just going to showcase teams from now on and uh, and give them, I guess, a rating out of 10 maybe. Um, and I think they'll all look very similar anyway, given just you know what we're all doing at the minute with Summer Heat and stuff. Um, but I think it'll be fun anyway. Let me know down below in the comments if you want anything changing. Um, and just from now on, Send in your teams throughout the week because I'm going to change up what days I record them uh, based on different SBCs. And I'm just going to do it surprisingly and differently so that everyone can get involved. Because I feel like sometimes on Saturday nights and Saturday evenings, you guys aren't always there to send in your teams. You guys have lives. You guys do a lot of things on Saturdays. Anyway, enough waffling from me. I do apologize. This is not an Arsenal t-shirt before you all assume. And yes, I still don't have a beard. Sadly, I can't grow facial hair that quickly. Um, I know it looks ugly. I'm sorry. Uh, we've got Alex Hunter's team. The Alex Hunter from The Journey has sent in his team. He says uh, this is his team. So looking at his team, I'm going to give it a rating wise. I'm going to give it a solid 8 out of 10. Uh, I'm not a big fan of Thiago Silva. And, and I'm really not a big fan of this Kalo Navas card either. But it's, apart from that, it's a great team. And obviously, anything summer heat wise is fantastic. They all have insane boosts. We've got James's team here. Uh, this is what he plays, and this is what he plays in game. He plays a 4 one 2 2 narrow. I respect it. I love the 4 one 2 2 narrow. I would say, uh, rating-wise, solid 9 out of 10. You've got meta players everywhere, apart from Varon. Not entirely sure why you've got... Oh, I mean, I know why you've got Varon chemistry, but I'm like... you got 900k, mate. You know? you got you got 900k. Uh, in my opinion, Paddy V, what are we saying in terms of... Uh, oops, I can't spell today. What are we saying in terms of price for Paddy V? Patrick Vieira, obviously not his moments card. Um, Prime's 1.7 million. The mid is zero coins. That's a steal. Uh, he's 800k. Still quite expensive, isn't he? I mean, I'd still go for it, though. He'd make a massive impact in the team. And then go ahead and play Vidal as a right centre mid. Um, and and Patrick Vieira as your CDM. I think that'd be a great uh, addition, to be honest. Um, we've got Ben's team here. Hmm, interesting. Uh, all three untradeable? I'm, have you, I'm guessing you've just started playing FIFA, I guess. Um, that would be my assumption. Very interesting. Why well, you've got Matip and Maguire at the back. Get yourself Joe Gomez and... Uh, who else would be a very nice cheap... I mean, that Johnny Egan inform card's not bad. I guarantee it's about 10k. Um, this card isn't too bad. Maybe get him at, at centre-back as well with, with Joe Gomez. And then get yourself... I don't know, normal car walker or Wamba or something like that, a right back. Um uh, but yeah, no, cool team. I mean, you've got some really good untradables, to be fair. Uh I see you doing a road to Salah, as it says. So I'm guessing it's like a road to glory around Salah. It's pretty cool though. It's pretty cool. Um, what do we have next? We have uh Anon's team, who is also known as 876 Miranda. He says, I've got 350k and everyone's untradeable, except for Carb Howard Oblak. What would you rate my team? Would you make any improvements? Uh let's check this out. I see that De Bruyne over there creeping through i like this team uh i would say a solid nine out of ten um the only difference is i would make is get yourself team of the season ramos whenever you can uh then obviously play carver hell on full chemistry um apart from that though his team is fantastic um and obviously in game he's playing a uh, a four and two and two i'm not entirely sure i play pog bridge cdm i think i'd play end on ballet cdm actually i think end has got a little bit more defensive stats than uh Pogba, if i'm not mistaken but 85 defending, so plus 4 defending on that card. I think he'd play a little bit better as a CDM than Pogba. Uh, but apart from that, fantastic. Uh, we have got Ethan's team, who says uh, he's got no coins at the minute. What can you rate my team? Let's check it out. Um, wow. 
You know what? This Venetia's card, not played against it yet in Weekend League, but I tell you what, it looks like a phenomenal card. Um, and it looks like it'd be incredible in game. I would say just kind of wait and try to save up maybe towards the Max Amin's for birthday card. Uh, apart from that, I mean, this team is fantastic. Both setups are incredible in game. Um, that is a, an insane team. And the, and the club name, you know what? You know, the club name really tops it off. You know, we're trying to hit 150k before FIFA 21. And I think it's going to be very difficult. We are on 146,500 subs. Uh, so it means we've got to get three and a half K uh, before October 2nd, I think is when early access drops or EA access. Um, so that's what we've got. July has got 11 days left. Um, so 11 plus 31 for August, 42 um, plus I think 30 for September, uh, another 30. So we've got 72 days to gain three and a half K subs. That's on average, I think 20 subscribers a day or no, 200 subs a day. Is it? I don't know. That that maths is off. I'm sorry. I've just embarrassed myself with maths. I think it's like 50 subscribers a day or something. We've got 72 days to get th three and a half K. Yeah, it's like it's like 50 subscribers a day. I think that's possible. I think it's definitely possible. Hopefully we could achieve that. I would love to achieve that. Um, we'll have to see though. We'll have to see. We've got Junior's team here. He says, uh, only tradable is Neymar. Second pick is in game. I've got 130k plus gold three rewards on Thursday. Let's go, dude. That's a mad team. 99 De Bruyne gang. I'd love to see it. I would say when you get rewards, mate, um i would just wait for another sbc i guarantee we get some form of sbc that's better than neymar and mbappe like i'm expecting the a to drop something because realistically we're like out of players now that that rival some of these players so we need we need to play that rivals on mbappe or a player that rivals neymar who that be i don't know who that might be but we'll see what happens i guess um but that team is incredible mate i guarantee you have a lot of fun with that team uh i am very jealous of it um very nice indeed we have got paul's team next i've got no money for upgrades i can easily save up uh i play the same in game interesting i would say maguire out do the maguire sbc if you really want to keep maguire um and uh and get yourself the team of the season because he's actually pretty decent in game um i would say also laporte out for again like a joe gomez is fantastic so go sort of that route i would say um benzema i'm not a big fan of either um striker wise from real madrid tough one maybe shapeshift of anisius uh apart from that though it's a good team uh, very nice team with all the shapes, uh, with all the summer heat, sorry. Uh, Steven's team now, out of 10, this is a solid 8.5 out of 10. I didn't like Delit when I used him, but that's just my personal opinion. Um, and I think that Rashford, whilst his football birthday is not bad, 5-star weak foot, there's better players you can get. And obviously, you know, get to level 30, mate, get yourself that 92 Tony Martial. Uh, but no, the rest of the team is fantastic, though. It is a really nice team. I do love the Maynard influence. So, you know, I'm going to bump that up to a 9 out of 10 for the Maynard influence, for sure. We've got uh, Luke's team next. All in trade, we've got 100k for upgrades. Again, loving the main night influence. Things you love to see. We got Bruno, we got Pogba, we got Dan James, we got Rashford. Um, I would say with this team, not much you can do to improve it. I, I just I'm not a big fan of of Roberto Carlos. Um, but you know, you've got him untradeable. There's no point getting anyone improved uh, than Roberto Carlos. He's fantastic uh, for a lot of people. Just for me, didn't like him that much. Alex Maguire's team now. Uh, second pick's what you play in game, and he's got 300 k. So check it out. Oh, okay. You got that Ben Shredder as well. Things you love to see. I tell you what, he opened a really good job of making like linkable summer heats. For example, a lot of French players, Premier League French players, Liverpool players, things like that. Like, like it works really well. I like that a lot. Uh, that team looks like a gold squad in game. That looks incredible. That's a solid 9.8 out of 10. Uh, the only uh, 0.2 that you don't get is because you, you're playing Mendy off chemistry with Ramos. Um, but realistically, you can't get Mendy on cam. That's why it's only a, a, a 0 0.2 that you lose. We've got David's team. Untradables are handed out. So you into a Puyo. The rest are untradable. Keep it the hard work. I hey, appreciate it, man. It's going to be a, you know, a long summer, I think, if EA don't drop a lot of content. Um, but I'm going to start rolling out some FIFA 21 content soon with like, things like rating predictions, uh, transfers, things like that. Some cool stuff that you maybe haven't seen on the channel before. But we're going to roll out some different types of content and see what you guys make of it. Obviously, you know, protruding to FIFA 21. Protruding? Is that the right word? No, it's not. Definitely isn't. Um, but this is what his team is. Rating out of 10 for me. I'm going to give it a solid 7.8 out of 10. Zola, big no-no for me. Puyol, huge no-no for me. Uh, eight chemistry goalkeeper, you know. Uh, Soyun Chu and in, in Man of the Match Pereira. You know, uh, not the biggest fan. And only 91 Bruno, you know. You know, unless you've got a huge player like a 99 De Bruyne like I have. Sorry to flex. Um, then you don't. You, you should have probably continued doing the Bruno if you ask me because it wasn't that difficult. Uh, we've got Jacob's team. 
This is my team. Everyone is untradeable. Got around 700k. Uh, yeah, let's put Kemsan on Pogba. Love the videos. Can you rate my team? I got you, bro. Um, yeah, wow. It's a nice team. 9.6 out of 10. Uh, the, the, the point four for me is Mendy off Kem again. And Desai, I don't know. Like, I love Desai. I think he's great in game, but I think there are better options, to be honest. Um, Tots Varane, maybe. I know, obviously, he's getting Pogba chemistry, but like a Tots Varane wouldn't be a bad shout. Um, you know what? No, nah, I'll give you a 9.8. I'll give you the same just for Mendy off Kem. Um, it's a fantastic team. It really is. That's just me being nitpicking. Um, we've got Gillen's team. Uh, out of 10, this is a solid 8.5 out of 10. Normal Areola, big no no. Um, I'm not entirely sure about Fabinho at CB. Obviously, you played David Luiz at CB, you know, but like starting off Kem, not sure how I feel about that. Um, I'm not sure about normal Messi at this stage of the game either. Not entirely sure, but, you know, decent team nonetheless. Um, we've got Carter's team, then Henry's team, and then actually we're going to end off the episode there. I'm going to do a bit of a short episode and see how you guys respond to it because I want to see if you guys, you know, still enjoy the short episodes. This is ridiculous, by the way. Um, how, what, where, when, how? Um, Carter, this team is absolutely ridiculous. I was just seeing if he's like a top 100 player or anything like that. Like, this is ridiculous. He's got Tots Neymar. He's got Moments Hullet, Moments Eusebio, Moments Cruyff, Moments Van der Sar, Moments Roberto Carlos. 99 De Bruyne. Like, I'm looking for the pro player card. Like... You know, where, how have you, how? This is, this is absolutely mental. I mean, GG on this, bro. This team is unbelievable. 10 out of 10. Incredible. Fair enough. The reason why I say I'm looking for the pro player card, by the way, for, for, for context there. Um, so EA give pro football players free uh, 99 rated pro card and then icons or players of their choice. You see a lot of pro players, for example, Dabo, I know plays foot champs. I think um, Tom Petz uh, plays foot champs as well. Um, there's a few of them that play foot jumps that have 99 pro cards. I've played against, uh, uh, forget his name. He's a French left wing back from standard Liège. It's going to be, an, this is going to annoy me if I don't get it. He's a silver card. He actually subbed on his pro player card against me. I also played Klosterman, um, from, from Germany. Uh, I played him, but this is going to, this is going to frustrate me if I don't find out who this is. Um, nation, popular France, uh, position, Left back slash left wing back. Um, is he on the front? No. What is his name? It's really annoying me. Um, Belgian Pro League. Uh, Gavary. There you go. Nicholas Gavary. This guy. I played this guy in, in foot jumps, actually, and I beat him, luckily. Uh, I lost to Klosterman. But yeah, they get like icon moments cards, incredible cards for free. So that's why I was like, come on, surely he's been given all these icons for free and like the 99 cards and stuff like that. But no, maybe not. Maybe just bought them big trader or, or spends a lot of money i don't know you know maybe just looking in packs uh henry's team is last though uh 400k for upgrades 431 in game uh i'm not really like looking to give huge upgrades here i mean i can help you out a little bit i'd say maybe get a cyprian over uh over at your boy essien here i think he gets a perfect link to sar and i think that's probably perfect um i'm pretty sure cyprian is still available um if i'm not mistaken if you have the coins go and do cyprian uh, get yourself the perfect link. And uh, apart from that, the rest of the team is insane. 99, uh, 98 Pele, 94 Ronaldo. Massive GG. I'm actually going to end it off real quick, right? A cool little transition. And my, my Elgato, for some reason, is, is super big. I do apologize for that. Um, I was not anticipating that to happen. I'm going to end off by showing you guys my team. For the first time in a long time, give my team a rating, why don't you? You know, I want to be selfish. It's my channel. <laughs> Joking. But, uh, you know, give my team a rating. What do you guys think? Obviously, we're running 4-2-2 two two in game. Mbappe and Benio are up top. Uh, uh, De Bruyne in behind with a uh, midfield of Hollett, Kante and Pogba. Defense stays as it is. Um, yeah, so much love. Uh, thank you all for watching the episode. Thank you all for the, for the epic support on the channel. You guys have been absolutely epic. Uh, much love, dudes. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for... I don't know what we'll drop tomorrow, but we'll drop another video. And then obviously, we'll just drop uh, IRA teams every Sunday. So just send me teams throughout the week, and I'll get to you then. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you lads later.